and welcome back to my channel today I want to come to you with a video on how to create Pandora stacks how to stack your bracelets what that can look like and how cute that can look and different ways um, to create a really fun looking stack that isn't traditional or standard um, that actually has a purpose and a reason for doing so so with the summer months coming up I tend to um, enjoy you know, mixing in my charms a little bit more to make a lighter look rather than stacking maybe two full size bracelets together, um, which I love to do, but sometimes that can get a little hot and a little sweaty during the summer months. So how do we create a little space between the charms and um, not make it quite so hot? So I wanna show you guys what I do. So I've got several different stacks put together out here. I wanna start with a pretty standard or simple stacking technique which is to take a regular bracelet and to stack a plain leather bracelet with it and this is actually a really great way to be able to still wear one of your standard Pandora bracelets but also to stack it with a leather bracelet and this leather bracelet is really lightweight really easy now you can also use this leather bracelet let's say you want to stack another bracelet and wear two bracelets together oh those are sticking together okay and you can use the leather bracelet to prevent the charms from banging into one another which is another great stacking technique that you can use um, I love to take a leather bracelet that maybe has some of the colors of the bracelet that I'm actually going to be wearing mixed into it so that it gives that kind of like a professional look like they were meant to go together so that's one way to stack bracelets and I think that's pretty standard you've probably seen that a few different times another really great lightweight option for the summer months coming up is to take a leather bracelet with maybe just a couple charms on it and a bangle bracelet with just a few charms on it and stack those together and wear them they're really lightweight you still get your fun charms on there but it's not going to get so hot and sweaty with the summer months because you know wearing really like full charm bracelets in the summer months they get kind of sweaty and then you got to wash your bracelets off when you come back in and i really do recommend that you wash down your bracelets when they've gotten sweaty please 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 do that because that's really prevents them from getting all um tarnished and starting to look you know that dingy color so these are the um Another stacking option, which is a simple bangle with a simple leather with maybe just a few charms, or you could do them plain as well, whichever way you want to do that. That's also an op option as well. And then I also like to, for the lighter weight, is take maybe a, a, a bangle bracelet with maybe a few more charms and a couple of bangle bracelets. And then I usually like to have at least one bigger one. This is a light uh, 20 centimeter bracelet. And then I have a couple of 19 centimeter bracelets and then stack them up. And um, that's really nice and lightweight, but still gives you that fun feeling of all the charms on there. That's a really fun way to stack up your bracelets um, with bangles because um, in the summer months we get a little warm. But let's say you still want to wear an actual full size bracelet. So let's talk about my rose gold stack. So you want to wear a full complete bracelet. So I have my, um, my beautiful uh, fantasy themed bracelet here. And then I take a plain bangle with the rose gold clasp because that's a rose gold bracelet. And then I take a plain rose gold bracelet. This is the locket one with the heraldic clasp. And then I would wear that. And then I would take my um, sliding bracelet with a few charms on it and then stack these guys together. And that makes a really fun. And it doesn't look nearly quite so um, claustrophobic on the arm, but it really does kind of keep it light because you only have really only one whole bracelet with charms on it so it actually makes it look like you're wearing a lot but you it really feels rather um, lightweight on your arm rather than like how heavy two or three full bracelets can be um, it's a lot lighter so that's one way I like to do it and I like to do it because you're getting different textures you get the little fun dangle of this one you get the little dangle of the heraldic clasp you get the stiffer um, bangle in there and then you have the more um, flexible but it's still full bracelet so it gives you lots of fun texture which I think is the thing that you want to do when creating a bracelet stack is to have different textures
pictures. Another thing that you can do, and I love to pull out, I've seen um, a lot of people have these bracelets, and I sometimes love to pull this one out, and I'll oftentimes pull it out and wear it with, you know, this one, because it's kind of got that mixed metal feel, or I'll even wear it with my Sleeping Beauty bracelet, which I think is fun too. So it kind of breaks up um, the, the styles of bracelets, so it gives you two fun different textures and looks. Um, and then sometimes I'll even like mix my Alex and Ani in with, like I go every other one, with the um, two different bracelets. So then I have my two Sleeping Beauty Alex and Ani in the golder colors. This one's like an old antique gold and this is a shiny gold. And then I have the Pandora bracelet with a Sleeping Beauty and then my little um, Sleeping Beauty on my older style charm bracelet here. The, I think they called them the Italian charms. Um, anyway, the, so this is the look that you can do there if you have one of these Italian charm bracelets or some Alex and Ani to mix in. I love Alex and Ani and Pandora bracelets together so if you have some Alex and Ani I think they look really cool. Here's another example of some Alex and Ani mixed in and this is where I'm taking an open bangle. I'm taking an Alex and Ani which is this cute little Mickey and Minnie one and then my Mickey and Minnie open bangle. A couple of Disney charms on there um, with, with uh, the chipmunk and then the clasp and then uh, Mickey and Minnie bracelet and stack those guys all together and I think that looks really cute especially being as you get some of the so many different textures the thinner bangle the thicker bangle the snake chain is showing through and then in this one is all the texture of the charms and it really just creates a fun little stack that you can do um, with your bracelet so those are some of the different ones now I also like to bring in um, sometimes some different bracelets. So like these are some really pretty pearl bracelets. You can stack those in with another bracelet, you know, and I love to do that with like this style of like look really girly and then it kind of showcases. So you got a bracelet on each side and it showcases your charm bracelet really well. So it's like still pretty lightweight because you're not adding another charm bracelet in, but you're still having something really pretty. And pearls are all the rage right now. So it's really fun to add in a pearl. You can also do the same thing um, with your bangle bracelets just to add in a little bit more texture when you're doing a bangle bracelet so you know the sky's the limits with stacking have fun bring your charms together and um, lighten it up a little bit for the summer months because I know for summer for me I really like to wear lighter weight jewelry um, because I found that when I wear the thicker um, charms or two or three charm bracelets they get really sweaty um, I know that's kind of gross but you know it happens we're all human um, and it can get kind of like yucky and then I have to wash off my bracelets and then I'm constantly having to do that every time I get home which is uh, you know who has time for that <laughs> so have fun this summer enjoy stacking your bracelets and ask me any questions you have about charms or um, bracelets or stacking or anything you want to know and let me know if you have any videos you'd like me to do in the description down below I would love to do what you want me to do um, as well so thank you for watching I hope you guys all like comment and subscribe and I will talk to you next time have a great day bye bye